and welcome back to Reka. Last time we added a little porch and we went further into sandbox mode just to see what was around. This time I think I really want to focus on building up our chicken hut and kind of closing off until there is another major update. But first get comfy, get cozy and we shall hop right on into it. So as I said, I do really want to focus on building up our lovely little chicken legged hut as much as is possible. And I, ooh, for me, for free. Ooh. Very nice, very nice indeed. Um, I do want to build up our chicken legged hut as much as is possible. And that's going to require a great deal oh, for free. A nightstand and an old wooden table. Thank you very much. It's going to require a great amount of wood, which is something I am very aware of, considering I have yet to have found another larch tree, though there's no more. There's I haven't seen any more. So we either test the limits of Leshy's boundaries here <laughs> uh, or we have a little look around still, like maybe we haven't seen quite everything. I'm just going to hop over here. Hello? I thought that was a fishing person. Because there's this one little branch on this tree. <laughs> I thought that was someone fishing. I was so confused. Okay. We're just going to hop over into this kind of rundown home. And we're going to just have a quick little run around just to see if we can find any kind of ancient larch tree. And if not, we're just going to have to... Ooh, that's fun. I'm just gonna have to we're just gonna have to see how much tree we can really chop here you know um okay how interesting this house is like half underwater for free <gasps> a table with a tablecloth and a large bell we got another bell I can interact with something else here, interestingly. There's another chest. I love that for me. Black Raven's coat. Oh, babes. Hell yeah. Okay. Um, I think this is probably it. For oh. oh my god, I could have missed it. That's so rude. High book stack. Old chair. Yellow book. Okay. Okay. And then there's another one. I could have missed all of this. I could have missed it. Another book. A blue cupboard with red flowers. That's so pretty. And gold. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> I don't think you understand how much I love loot and free things. I love loot and free things. Thank you. Another chair and some gold. Love that for me. Um, this is just lighting the candles. That's fine. Okay, so where are we right now in terms of the... Okay, we're like right in the center. I've been around, I'm pretty sure. So I don't think there is an ancient larch tree here. Not one that we're going to find anyway. That's okay. That is so okay. It just means that we, we are going to have to be brave. Okay, and we're going to have to try and chop down some of the... Ooh, for free. I'm gonna have to chop down some of these trees and hope that we don't anger Leshy. That that is not a mechanic. So we're just gonna chop that down. We're gonna grab some of this wood. Cause we have many a rooms to build up and we can always build up more in the future. But I would like to, before we kind of wrap this up temporarily while we wait for the next update um, with more story and stuff in it, which I think is coming early next year. Until then, um, we just, we want to make our, our home at least somewhat complete, right? I want to have full joy and full reign in, in seeing what we can do with it. That's so pretty. That's so pretty. There are tiaras. There are tiaras in this. Jar with a plant. Thank you very much. That's so incredibly pretty is there anything on this wagon i think i see a chest i see a little silhouette of a chest large saw table with dark tablecloth 
that matches our bed, so I'm all for that. Um, now, obviously, I'm just having a little bit of a look around, babes, as we as we gather. I'm not quite sure that's that's what that's supposed to look like, but um, it is a freebie, and I will take it. Large saw, lovely. Thank you for that. Um, yeah, we're just having a look around for some some decorations that we can gather like from here because it's just the more the merrier to go in the house you know a war uh, a shelf and a pumpkin lovely i love both of those things thank you so much i see something else over here maybe i was correct and there's our chicken legged hut so we can start walking towards that an axe <gasps> oh that's beautiful the hanging plant rack that's beautiful Let's grab a branch here just in case and let me just look at the map again. So we are well over here now and I just want to check this really quickly. Is there a tree in it? Do I have to put honey in it? No, that's okay. Is there anything else to it? No. Okay, so we just want to potentially not chop this tree down. Oh wait, can I? <gasps> a moth! There was a moth! I took the moth! We just want to potentially get a couple trees, okay? We don't want to be too greedy with it, but I don't have any more enchanted larches. And I think I saw another hunting tower somewhere. I did, yes. Yeah, so we can get that wood as well. And just close off the space that we are building. Lovely. And then we just want to collect all of that up delightful okay so we've been there there is another little campsite over there that i very quickly would like to just check in on because i can't imagine i haven't looked at it but i feel like i can see freebies you know and if there's freebies i'm <laughs> i'm guns to want the freebies there is freebies that oh my god there are both both freebies are available a candle which is grand because we always always need lighting and then an ivory blouse with a midnight floral bodice Ooh, that's so pretty sounding okay can we see anything else on the immediate horizon i'm not seeing anything i think it might be time to chicken legged hut check in but i'm just gonna hop out this way just a little ways to see if there is anything that i'm missing if there's anything over here. It doesn't look like that's the case. So we can we can swing back around. Oh, what's that? What is that? What do I see? Ah, yes, the mushroom circle. Never mind. <gasps> For free? This is why we look. We got another fireplace. More lighting. That's perfect. The fireplaces do so much work for lighting up a space. I love that. And also we had, don't think we've been in here, have we? Might as well check it out real quick. Uh, hello. See, look, we could have missed a sack. <gasps> Skull on a pedestal. I mean, it's just the jaw, but it's pretty cool. And a dark clay mug. Jug rather. That's, <laughs> that's not a mug. It's a jug, but still, oh my God, this is so sneaky. I would never have seen those rose incense <gasps> and a flower bouquet. That is so sneaky. I can't believe them. All right, let's more free stuff. <laughs> It is more free stuff. Ooh, a large blue bench. Okay, okay, okay. All right, it's time. Let's go back to our chicken legged hut, okay? Before I get completely, completely turned around and distracted. Because what we want to do today, very importantly, is build up our lovely chicken legged hut. Um, for the time, ooh, is there another moth? There is another moth. I'm gonna grab this as well. 
Because I feel like you can never have too many, you know? You know what's interesting is I don't think there's any, like, deer in these parts. And I would love it so much if there was, like, another critter that we could bring home with us. But that's okay. Okay, right. Let's get back home. And start building this chicken-legged hut right up. So... Just taking another little look real quick. We made this beautiful balcony area, which I love so much. I feel like I might want to close that up a little bit or something. Or just build that, maybe put something up there as decoration. And then we built this lovely area up that we also need to kind of work on a little bit. Do you have anything in your little chest for me, Bagabee Yaga? I haven't seen my sisters in so long. Nothing further. I wonder if we'll meet the sisters in one of the future updates. That would be very, very cool. Okay, so let's go upstairs. Because we had this area and we've nearly finished um, roofing it up. So let's open our build menu and we are just going to go ahead and grab this section. Here, we're going to hop up here. Ooh, never mind. <laughs> I forgot I still needed stairs for that. Uh, and we are just going to place that there. So now you can come up the ladder a little bit and it will transform into stairs. It's not terrible. It's not the, the best thing, but it's something, you know. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Please give me that back. Thank you. And we're just going to lay a lot of this flooring sort of down and across. Uh, not there, obviously. So we're just going to do here and here and here and here. I'm going to try and be as speedy with it as I can. But I often, when I'm trying to be speedy, I'll place it in all the wrong places. And then I have to go and pick it all back up, you know. <laughs> um, okay, so that's fine. And that's going to be an enclosed little area real soon. So let's just wall that off as much as can be right here as well and we can put in some extra windows whenever we feel like it real soon um but for now let's just continue that along there beautiful and it's feeling very dark and this is one of the reasons that i would quite like to get as much of the lighting as we can from running around and collecting those decorations um hmm I think this is just going to be a regular room, if I'm being honest. So what I'm going to do for now, and hear me out here, is we are just going to wall this bad boy up. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. I don't know how soon we're going to run out of wood. <laughs> but I have to imagine it's going to be soon-ish, right? We just want to make a nice oh, tall ceiling all the way across as much as is possible, essentially. And then I think I'd quite like to frame this. Not enough resources! No! What did I just say about wood? <laughs> no! Okay, that's fine. But this gives us an opportunity to very quickly put some more... Um, decor down, if that is a tool. Can I get on here? I can. Oh, we shouldn't though, because I feel like I'm going to get trapped. Okay. Uh, we can put some more decor down. So let's see what we've got, if there's anything we might want to add to this space. What is this? this? Is a barn chest, blue cupboard with flowers, troughs. Hmm, that's small furniture. Let's go big furniture here. We did just get... Uh, wardrobe. Where is that wardrobe? Is it not in here? No. What do you mean? We do have this table, though, which is kind of cool. And we could put that sort of behind the stairs. If it will let us, it will not let us. So, uh, if I... Oh, you know, it might. It, it might just let us put it behind the stairs. And then we can store stuff behind the stairs. Or hear me out here we could store some um big piles of wood 
up. <laughs> uh, like right there, like as a little divider for the spaces. I don't hate that as an idea, right? So let's just straighten that out. Let's place that like that and then do this as well. Kind of have it almost like it's piling up. Okay. Okay, I like that. I, I like that. It kind of divides the spaces a little bit, no? Very nice. Very, very nice. And then, um, hmm. And then we've got some, like, little wood piles. I could put, like, one of these over here. Actually, no, I can't. Never mind. So we'll leave that one. Oh, this is where the wardrobe went, babes. I don't think I'm going to get it anywhere down here, am I? Much as I might like to. I mean, you could put it right here, but it's not going to look good. Okay. We'll come back to the wardrobe. Can I store stuff on that wardrobe, though? Maybe we just use it as, like, a cool-looking cabinet, you know? I could be down for that. We'll come back to that. We're gonna... Listen, we're gonna come back to it. Don't you worry. I want more hanging things, you know? I love the hanging mushroom so much. I wish there were more hanging things. Um, we have this sack of flour we could put back here, maybe... Like, right on the end here, maybe. Maybe. I'm going to come back to that as well. Okay, what else do we have? Lots of hanging herbs and things. Can I put those in the windows? Oh my god, I can. Stop it. Stop it. That's, that's adorable. That's adorable, and you can't tell me it's not. Look at that. Look at, look at those adorable little windows. I'm sorry. But that's adorable. Oh, I love that so much. Okay. In, oh, wool things. Wait, what is that? Oh, it's mugs. That's mugs. And we got this bottle one as well, didn't we? And then there's axes and wheels and stuff. But though, oh, babes, these ones. This little, like, bottle holder I'm not mad at. And then we've got decor. We need to work on that. I like this little box. That's so cute. We need to work on the decor for sure. That's going to come later. What I need is illumination, you know? Desperately. And what I might use is this corner for a little bit of illumination. So let's put this big one like kind of like back here. And then we can have some smaller candles near nearish it. And we can get some levels going there. Is this not oh no no, this is a yeah. Okay. Not you. That's perfect too. Look at that. And we've got like a nice little candle corner. I really, really like that. And I might just add like a tiny decoration. If I can. If we've got one small enough. It would go really well there. It might have to be this. Which is the incense. And I'm not mad about it. That can go there. And then we've got like this nice little just little place and it's really badly placed because that's firewood and that will go up in flames but <laughs> we don't talk about that we don't talk about that okay what we need to do is get some more wood evidently we're, we're already out of wood the wood is an issue for us it is indeed an issue for us have we been to the townspeople here let me get out of build mode um, and let's just walk out a second. Just real fast. We've been over there. Is that the, the one house that we went to? I'm assuming... Oh, it's a rock. Never mind. But I'm assuming we did because this is open. Yeah. Oh, look, I can see the, the shrine. Let's go to the shrine. Let's get this shrine thing done 
and then we'll we'll go talk to the townspeople a little bit. Have we already done the moon one? Did we already light you? We oh we must have. Okay, so that you're lit. We've got the sun and the stars to do yet. Or not the star, the um the sunrise. Okay, all right. Let's have a look in our journal real quick. Um, quests. So I'm just gonna be expanding the house and exploring nature in the meantime. Let's see what the future holds. Yeah. Okay. So we could hop to the village and see what they want from us. See if there's anything that we can fulfill for them. Uh, where is the village? Just well, obviously we have to wait to be able to do any more of those. Uh, you know what? I could just wait around until... So, you know, you know what? We'll go to the village first. We can always come back as soon as it's sunrise. The village isn't that far away. So let me do this little walk and I'll bring you in when we find the villager that needs that shrine. Oh, hello. An unfamiliar face. We don't get too many of those around here. Welcome to our village. You want some food? What can I offer you? You want a small savory meal. Like salt, pancake, porridge with fruit and honey. Garlic soup, would you like? Yes. Ah, that hit this. Oh, this is the first one that's actually been thankful. That's <laughs> that's insane. You're so welcome. Thank you for the 60 gold, the flower. <gasps> that's huge. Thank you for the wood. That's that's incredible. Thank you so much for the wood. May you have a wonderful time zone. OK, cool. Bogdan is back. I love that for Bogdan. Uh, there's no one in here. There's someone else in here. Hello. I ran our party the other day. Can I get some of your food? Maybe a savory meal. Pierogies? Yes. I really wanted more than that. Wow. Well, you know, that's that's tough titties, to be honest with you, babes. Thanks for the gifts, though. That's very nice. Um. Hello. Wait, who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Can I help you? Have you heard anything interesting? Chicken farmer has been having problems with their birds lately. Could be worth you looking into. <gasps> There's a chicken coop. Can I? Hi, Bogdan. I want to find something out when we get there. I already found that. That's fine. Uh, vase with wheat in it. No, that's okay. Um, salt. You've got honeycomb. Book with lavender. Anything else I want? Portrait of a black cat I do kind of want. Yeah, it's coming with me. I'm sorry. Bye, Bogdan. Wait, have you heard anything from around here? No. Okay. What I want is this chicken coop. Where is it? Oh, is there a confused person maybe? Is that what that is? And also, where is the person that wants the shrine doing? That's what I need to know. Okay, so this is, this is bees. Where is... Hello. You heard anything interesting? So shrine I like to visit sometimes, it belongs to Zoya, or so my Bubushka used to say. I don't quite know what it means, but it's a sight to behold. You should go there if you have the time. Okay, we've already found that. And I'm going to do it, and that's fine. Um, what I want is this chicken hut. Where is it? To give me... What is this? Where is... Where is the chicken? Chicken coop. Give me the chicken coop. Yes! Yes! Take me to the chicken coop. It is of the utmost importance. Is it this? Is this the chicken coop? Hello? Are you the chicken coop person? Yes. Hello. Uh, I hear you having problems with your chickens. Well, yes. Yes, I have. My chickens were my pride, my absolute pride. The finest birds in all Jawia? Jawia? Best plumage, tastiest eggs. Now two are dead and the others have not laid any eggs in weeks. And you know what? I know who's responsible. It's Sonia. Sonia's behind all of this. We worked together in the past and then we decided to go our separate ways. 
It's been going too well for me and I can smell the jealousy pouring off them every time I see them. Would you be willing to find out what is being done to my beautiful birds? There's, there's a rival coop. There is a rival, there's a rival coop. I didn't know this game was going to have tea. I didn't know we were going to get <laughs> chicken rivalry. Oh, color me intrigued, babes. Are you? Ah, Sonia, did you do something to the chickens? You're a witch, right? I, uh, I didn't want it to be this way. I'll come clean with you. It's all down to this other witch I hired. I told her to hinder the business. Do mean for the chickens to suffer? Enough is enough. Please, can you can you stop this? She said she placed a cursed object in the coop. It was a bone, I think. Does that help? <gasps> that is intriguing, Sonia. I am going to find that a cursed object. I should. <gasps> we should ask Baba Yaga how to deal with it. Okay. Okay, good. I just want to see if you've got any goodies for me. A light chicken nest. And then there's um, there's one over here as well. What I want to know is if I complete this quest, do, do they, are they, I need them to give me a chicken, okay? I need... I need them to get... <laughs> And you have to give me a chicken. I want new friends. I have the perfect place for it as well. Like I know exactly where I want to put that chicken. So please, I need you, I need you to give me the chicken. Okay, you're looking for a bone in here. Where is it? Oh, I can just steal a chicken. But I need to ask Baba Yaga about it. Oh. We have to ask Baba Yaga about it. Okay, where is our chicken hut? All the way down here. Okay, cool. Go over here. It's still nighttime. We do want to keep an eye on that. Um, because as soon as it is morning, we're going to want to go to the shrine, essentially. Large saw. Stags go with flowers. Some gold. You love to see it. We'll be on our way. Honestly, I thought it was just going to be the same puzzles. I didn't know we were going to get chicken tea. I'm so, so excited by this chicken tea. Oh my goodness. Okay. Over we pop. It, it feels a little slow running at the minute. I'm not quite sure why. Uh, it might just be difficult terrain kind of in and out of the water. It's very marshy where we are. That could be fine. Okay, my little chicken hut, lower yourself down, you pressure. I'm going to bring a chicken home. If they give me one or not, I'm I will steal a chicken. I will take it. As an offering and as as a, a taken thank you for not poisoning you all with the fly agaric that I have, okay? Hello, my sweet chicken legged hut. Let's go see Baba Yaga. Hello, Baba Yaga. Uh, how do I deal with a cursed object? You've come across a cursed object, hmm? If it's nothing too major, then your birds should be able to deal with it. Send them towards the object and the curse should be lifted. But be wary. Someone must have carefully created and placed this object where it is. Not sure you're ready to start stirring up too much trouble with other witches. Unless they deserve it, of course, then it's open season. Oh, and it wouldn't hurt to cleanse the place afterwards. Mark and protect your territory. Um, we already know how to cleanse an area, no? With the pine branches, but we'll click it anyway. Eager to learn, are you? The first part of it you already know. Smoke the area with a pine stick. And be thorough, you do not want to miss a spot. Bad energies will get in anywhere they sense a crack in the cleansing. Next, you will need some black salt. Place it in all four outermost corners of the house. That way you create a distinct space that is cleansed. This should suffice for your regular cleansing needs. That's all there really is to it. You could always put a bit of theatre into it. Wave the stick a lot. Mutter. Everyone likes a good mutter from a witch. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
sometimes witchcraft isn't just about what a witch does, but how they do it. Of course, it works just as well without the theatrics, but I'm somewhat of a traditionalist. I have to agree. I have to agree to a point. I am so oh, it's it's daytime. Day daylight. It's daytime. Take me to the shrine. Uh, well, it's sunrise, and then we want to wait around for um the actual daytime as well. No, it took it off. It took it off. Take me here, damn it. I have, yeah, I have to agree. I think a little bit of theatrics, a little bit of like really putting yourself into something and feeling it as you're doing it as part of your craft can make the world of difference. Even if it's just to you internally or if it's if you're working with a client, for example. Um, either way, I think it can be helpful in more than one way, in more than just like helping you feel it or helping someone else feel it. But it's kind of like, um, I don't know, I think it helps you get into the right headspace as well. Like not, not quite trance, but almost into the right kind of brain space for it. I love a bit of theatrics as well. I mean, I'm an ex-theater kid. <laughs> it's what I do. Okay, I am just going to stick around here and wait just for this one to change because I don't think the sunrise cycle is quite as long as the night cycle. Oh, no, you know what? We won't wait. We won't. Actually, I've decided not to. We're going to the chicken coop. We're going to do the thing. And when, by the time we come back, it'll be daytime. Why waste the time, you know? Why, why waste the time? We need not waste the time. And then after we've done both of those things... Oh, have I been in this one? Oh, I haven't. Give it to me. <laughs> Dark canopy bed and a barn chest. Uh, after we've done both of those things, we can go ahead and build up some more of our chicken-legged hut. And again, we're just going to test test the limits of, of Leshy's generosity here with us. Because what else is a girl supposed to do? We did get some wood from the, the villager. So there's that, but still... Okay, so which is the chicken coop that we want? We wanted the one like right on the edge of town, right? So I think the one we are approaching is the correct one. And what I'm wondering as well is when we get back home, uh, after we finish that particular um, shrine, are we going to get the same portrait? The same piece of art? Uh... Not there. Not you. Okay, so it's on the other side of town. That's fine. Let's go cleanse the area. Should I? Oh, no, I'm not going to collect that. I do wish we could increase our backpack space, essentially. Cursed object. It's the bones up there. That's lovely. And then we want to... I didn't mean to um, pick you up. I'm so sorry. What I meant to do was cleanse. Lovely. We go in and out. Fabulous. And then we want to put some... Salt in all of the corners. <gasps> no! I'm out of salt! No! I have to come back! No! No! Bogdan! Bogdan, I need your salt so I can make black salt. No, that's terrible. Okay, let me buy some salt. Oh, I didn't mean... Oh, I didn't even notice I was buying it. I was like, why is nothing popping up for me? <sighs> okay, let's go back to our chicken-legged hut. Let's make some salt. And then I'll stop by the shrine on the way, uh, on the way back from the hut, I think, because it's still very much in the sunrise position, I feel. So let me get us home and we'll make some, some lovely sort of black salt. Okay, the salt, done. We have that, we can go back, but we, uh, we did wait for sunrise to work in today. So now this is done, we can see what, okay, we get the same... 
The same thing, that's good to know. So what we can do in the future is avoid doing that because I don't want too many of those. As funny as it would be to have an entire chicken-legged hut that is completely wallpapered with that piece of art, because it's nice art, um, I, I would like it to be a little bit different from that, so. Um, interesting, very interesting. I have missions here that I have not picked up, which is just interesting. I don't know if I've been in this place. Yeah, I have, I have, I have. This is this place, yeah? Yeah, we've been in there. Okay, let's go back to the village. Let's finish this little cleansing ritual. And then uh, I think the, the picture one is, is throwing black salt into the fire. And I do have an extra black salt at home if I need it. So but what I really want to focus on, obviously, is is like building up the walls around our chicken legged hut. So as much as I can, I do want to kind of focus on that a little bit more once we've done this. Uh, also, we do want to steal a chicken. It's going to happen. I need the chicken. OK, I have the perfect little spot for it. There we go. And there we go. So this is now done. Yes. And I can speak to you. I've cleared the chicken coop of a cursed object. A cursed object? I did not think Sonya would stoop so low. Anyway, thank you. This is for you. <gasps> Two more of the doors. A basket with mushrooms? That's so cute. Water trough, gold. <gasps> they gave me a chicken. I don't have to steal a chicken. I don't have to steal a chicken. Can I talk to Sonya and be like, hey, I I fix this for you. Pay up, cough up. Give me freebies, please. <laughs> Sonya. Sonya, would you do, do me the honor? Pretty please. Hello. Hey, how are you? Uh, okay, goodbye. So, no, I'm not allowed to do that. But you know what I could do? Where are you keeping your chickens, Sonya? Huh? That's what I want to know. Can I steal one of yours? I'm assuming it's a no, because... Yeah, it's a no. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, all right. Let's, let's just get back... I buy some wood. 14 coins. That's Bogdan, really? Really? That's so much money. For a little bit of wood. I mean, yeah, I guess I also don't want to incur the wrath of Leshy, so... I think I'm just going to get one more tree. And then I'm not going to push our luck any further. Or maybe like a couple more trees. <laughs> and then, for sure, we're not pushing our luck any further. So let's go ahead and grab some of these bigger. I can't get you to, no. Just gonna get some of these bigger trees. And we're gonna do it near the town so we can almost blame it <laughs> on the villagers, you know? It wasn't me, Leshy, <laughs> it was the village folk. Those terrible village folk, you know? That's, that's, that could be us. That could be, <laughs> it could be us. Um, and then we'll get this tree as well. Okay, that's it. Uh, I won't get any more wood because I fear, I fear Leshy. And I respect Leshy and I don't want to take the mick, you know? Oh, <gasps> for free! What do we get? A pink cabbage. That cabbage actually looks pretty pretty slay if i do say so have we been in here just really quickly i just want to double check some things make sure i'm not missing anything we've been in here i'm assuming so because i see no hanging things yeah we've been in here okay onward to our chicken like a tut let's finish building up around these walls and then and then I think we're going to round this off here until we get another kind of major update. Until we come out of sandbox mode a little bit. As much as I enjoy sandbox mode, 
I know they're going to keep updating this game. And that's going to come with new decorations and a whole bunch of new things that we can incorporate within our chicken legged hut. So I'm just going to seal up the rooms that I have made and make sure they are beautiful and give us the options to make more rooms in the future, do you know? That is the plan so far. And honestly, this, this hut is looking spec spectacular babes what i might do is i know i made this but i might pick up all of that wood and just close off the rooms we do have make sure they're all decorated go from there ah oh, no wait wait everything must wait i have the place the chicken place i must place i need to figure out a way to get up there uh i want to place this chicken up here i might have to jump up from up okay yeah, yeah, yeah. we can do that we'll go upstairs we'll go upstairs and we'll place the that's where i want the chicken to go obviously Obviously, it's the perfect chicken location. It's perfect. Okay, build. Give me... Give me friends, please. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Thank you. And then I'm just gonna... I'm gonna... Like, right here. And we're just gonna turn you, babes. Delightful. And you're gonna go... Right there. And I did not mean to put that down. I'm going to pick that up and I'm going to put it right next to you. As like a little feed bowl. Delightful. And then I'm going to put some lighting near you as well. This little chicken foot torch thing is very, very cute. Don't look too much into it, okay? Just don't, don't think about it. Don't, don't you think about it. I'm going to put another one like right next to it. Just to like really amp up the light there. And then I would love to find some... Uh, yes, exactly. Not the basket of mushrooms. We've got this nest. Which is like ever so slightly bigger. But that's not what I want to put down. I want to put down... Yes, this is what I want. This is absolutely what I want. Okay, so what is that? This is black salt. I don't want to put black salt down. This is raspberries. I could give you some raspberries over here, you know. This is our lucky chicken, okay? So we want to put that down. I do. I would love to give you a little pumpkin if I can fit it on there. But that's going to be a whole issue. Not that one. Okay, we might have to accept the placement that it gives us if it gives us one. Again, can I just have that back, please? Okay, that goes there. Lovely. And then, uh, what is this? Jam. Porridge. Honeycomb. Put some honeycomb up here. This is, this is the chicken. Some salt I don't want to give to you. Just in case. We could put the little cabbage up here as well. Yeah? Little, little onion? I'm trying really hard. I'm gonna stand on your nest and I'm really, I'm quite sorry. Please forgive me. But I just want to like make sure it looks really nice up here for you. What is, this is raspberries. We have some flour up here, I guess. It could have kind of looked like grains. Um, but it's not gonna let me place that, so... Never mind. I don't want to put that up there with the chicken. Alright, this is going to have to do for now. So we've got our lovely chicken area up there. Oh my goodness. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and put some beans up. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, lovely. So you there. And you there. And you there. Does that work or did I go too far? Oh, I went too far. Can I have that back, please? No! Okay, there we go. One and two. We're going to do the same here. One and a two. Thank you. And then, mm, see how I feel about the rest of that. Let's just go and put... Uh, the rest of our kind of walls up around here as much as we can. I am 
just listen, listen to me, hear me out, hear me out, temporarily, give me these, I am going to take this back. And that's, that can be something that we add later. Let's just take a little step back here. And then you, just so we can, we can finish this up, right? Okay. There we go. One, two, three. And we're going to pull that. Oh, where did I put that? Who knows? <gasps> no, give me that back. <laughs> you and you, you and you and you and you and you and you. That's perfect. Am I going to... Yeah, you know what I am. I'm going to... Gonna board some of this up. I'm gonna leave that as like a nice little window, I think. Oh, it's not gonna let me. But I might be able to put a window in there, you know? <gasps> no, give me that back. Okay. Okay, we're fine. It's fine. I'll just try I'll try and put a window in there, you know? Okay. Okay, we've got a room. We've got a room. Can I put a window in there? I read. I would love it. Absolutely, I would love it. Adore it, even, if they could give us some bigger windows, okay? Okay, so I kind of want this to be very central. Lovely. And then if I go ahead, I'm not going to be able to open that. That's fine. No. Okay, okay. That's fine. That's fine. We... Mm, no, I don't like that. Give me that back. Give me that back. Thank you. I don't like it. It looked weird. There we go. Okay, what I might do... Is open this up here and this up here. And then hear me out. We can make um, that there. Okay, no, I, oh no, I biffed that. Oh, I've gone and biffed that. Can I have that back, please? Thank you. What I really want. Can I do that? Yeah, but it doesn't look very good, does it? No, <laughs> no. That's what I wanted. No. Oh, I'm, I'm fully biffing it. I'm... See, that's what I wanted. But it's going to have these little gaps here, you know? I'm not going to lie to you, that's a little rough. But we might have to make do with it. Okay, we'll see. It does bring a lot of light into the space, so I might keep it. I prefer these windows to the windows they give you, I think. I think they look a lot nicer and a lot more structured. But let's finish up with the ceiling real quick. Oh, no, not you. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Now I've got to fix that. This is why we don't spam, okay? Because it always goes in the wrong place. Okay. Are we going to be able to finish this all up? Don't leave me with like one space. Like, oh, thank God. Okay. All right. It's not so bad. Is that like a gap? Is that a full gap? Floor to ceiling? Is that a gap? I don't know. We'll have to see. So now I have this room, which I'm going to dub my steering room. Oh, I kind of wish we had diagonals, you know? Because I don't like leaving this. Like, I want this to be free. Uh, okay, what if we do this? Okay, and then, and then, yeah, hear me out. Hear me out. Give me that back. Give me that back. That's not too bad. And then that's like our little, our little way to... I would love it if I could, if I could move this. 
and like turn that around and have that face out of there. Yeah. Perfect. So we've got our like our visual. This is where. Oh my god! I didn't know it moved. <laughs> this is our little visual. I quite like it. Uh, but we should see what that looks like from the outside, I think, before we make any kind of decision on that. I do think this is looking fab, I have to say. Okay. So we've got our... Yeah, I don't, I don't mind that. I really don't mind that. Especially if we can keep making it look like... Hmm. Like it is put together. I don't know if that makes any sense. Hold on, let's just... That's, that's cute, right? And then we can hang things. We can hang things for the chicken. I like that. If, if we can keep making this look well, well put together, you know, we can cut out some of these spaces for some more windows because we absolutely should. What we're missing here is indeed wind. Oh my God. Baba Yaga has a present. <gasps> a kitty. You gave me a kitty cat, Baba Yaga. Let's keep it away from the bunny. Can I put it in here? Can I put it on my bed, more importantly? Can I put the kitty cat on? Oh my god, I can. And it blends in. Hold on. <laughs> Stop. Wait, hold on. Hold on. I can put it on the bed and it kind of blends in. Maybe we shouldn't, though. Can I put it on the chair? Kind of? I'm going to put the kitty cat here, I think. Yeah. Hi, kitty cat. Oh, best gift ever. Thank you, Baba Yaga. Oh, baby. I love that. Okay. Um, going the wrong way. So we're gonna, we're gonna add, we're just gonna add some, some extra windows. And um, that's there. So I kind of want to add one, two. I'm thinking one like right here. So give me that back. And then... That was one and two. Okay, one and two. And we're going to take this. We're going to make that into a little window. Beautiful. One and two. And one and two. And boop, boop. And boop and boop. That's why it's been so dark. We've not had any windows. This is fabulous. I am going to, I am going to match it on the other side just for now. Just for now. Yeah, and then I can't match it over here. I kind of can. I kind uh give me that back. I kind of can. No, give me that back. No! Oh my god. It's like rage placing blocks in Minecraft all over again. <laughs> Yay! Okay, let's do that. Thank you. And that. And then we do it here as well. Okay, so we've got it matched on either side. And now it's like flooded with light in here. That's fantastic. Okay. Okay, we're getting places. It's taking us some time, but we are getting places. And I'm 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 happy with that. I'm cool with that. I'm going to put this little sconce right up here, I think. It's like a nice place to put that. And let's keep going. It would be nice to add like a nice little book nook. So I'm going to keep all of those for now. I'm going to keep the red metal box. Hmm. <gasps> the portrait of the black cat. This can go on my mural wall. Hold on. Hold on. I forgot I picked this up. Hold on. Oh, you know what? I already have one. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. You know what? I can keep an extra one up here. Next to... Oh my god, it can be yours. Would you like a nice little framed picture of a kitty cat? You are so welcome. <laughs> That's so cute. I can't. Okay, we can put this downstairs. Because this is where we would keep... Oh, you know what? We already have one. That's nice. We could add another one but I don't see much point. But we could add one of these. That would make sense. Um, like right, right here, maybe. I love that. Where is the one that hangs from the ceiling? 
It's like massive. Where is it? There it is. This is what I want. I'm gonna hang that like right there. Perfect. Perfect. Oh my goodness. And then this, this little crow skeleton mobile can come up here. Uh, I'm thinking like more central into the room. Like right there. That, oh my god, yes. Oh my god, yes. Ah, I love this so much. Okay. Okie dokie. Do I want any more things up here? No. Now the question is, what do I do with this room? Because this is now... Uh, oh, you know what? I need to move this. So it looks like we have a steering wheel. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 wait. Perfect. Perfect. Look at that. We got a steering wheel. Okay. Um, we can have a chest up here. Actually, I think that that would work well if we have one like kind of like right next to the stairs. And then what I was thinking is we should have some like nightstands. So small furniture. Yeah, we've got this little this little nightstand. Uh, but we've got other little things as well. Like this is quite quite sweet. Oh, you know what? That would have gone better there. But that's okay. It's okay. I'm gonna put you know, it should be a table. We should have tables up here, shouldn't we? And I just have like a schmegular, regular schmegular table. I go with this one, I think, for now. Nice, very nice. And we can put stuff on that table. When, when the time comes, and in the meantime, I don't have two of any of these things. Oh, you know, what? I have two of these. So I could tuck this in like right here. And this could be where people can sit if they want to like chill whilst we move, you know, keep me company while we drive. That's very sweet. Okay. I do think we might want some lighting over here as well. So let me put this down here. Let me put one of these down as well. I love that. And I think that's about what, oh, you know what? We should put a book stack over here too. Right, right there. Delightful. Okay, I think that's about like the limit of what we can do with this space right now. Keep that on. Isn't that lovely? How, look, let's have a look from outside. This, I love our kitty cat as well. Let's just have a little look from outside and see how it's looking from the front and like from the sides and stuff. Now that, oh, I know it's very square right now. I know, I know, and we will make it better. And I know we've made a mouth here <laughs> and a face. We will make it better, but um, for now with what we have available, I am loving this. And I look forward to making more spaces with it in the future with future updates. But thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a fantastic time zone. You stay fed, watered, rested. Know that you're loved because I love you. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.